you know what that means? I'm about to start traveling again. Just got a shower. It's about, I think, one, maybe two in the morning. Uh, I'm heading out to Krakow, Poland. Well, actually, I'm flying into Prague uh, tomorrow. And I'm taking a train to Krakow to go to the tattoo convention there this weekend. After that, we meet up with some people. We're probably going to go check out Auschwitz. And then I'll head up to Warsaw, where we're going to see Slayer. That's right. And then from there, we're going to take another train back to Prague to see Slayer again. So it's going to be a Slayer-filled week of awesomeness in the Eastern Bloc of Europe. Even though it's not really the Eastern Bloc, but I like to pretend it is. My music just faded. Anyway, welcome back to Body Mind TV. I'm your host, Adam, and I'm getting ready to travel to the Krakow Tattoo Convention of 2010. As you can see by the mess that I've made here, I'm trying to get everything in order. I got my flyers, cameras, books, money, blah, blah, blah. I'm trying to copy over some movies on the computer and all that other fun stuff. Um, trying to think. Uh, I'm not really sure who's going to be there, but there's a possibility that I might be getting my chest work done by Robert Hernandez. Maybe. Fingers crossed. Don't want to spill my drink. Anyway. Yeah, so that's about it for that. But what I also want to do here is a quick review of a book. And the book is Pint Size Paintings. Miniature Paintings by Big Artists. Right here. Yep. This is the review I want to do. Um, this book, I picked this up at the Hell City Tattoo Convention. Um, it's put together by Derb Morrison and I think a couple of the people. I'm not sure. Let's check this out. Freaking awesome. I'm going to go through and show a little better detail. But anyway, I just, I just want to make sure I'm giving the right credit here. I know Derb Morrison has a huge thing to do with it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Uh, book design layout, Derb Morrison and uh, Tony Terrell. So there we go. Um, but after seeing all the paintings in person, I could not not get this book. It's amazing. Unfortunately, not all the paintings made it to the book, so only the best of the best made this thing. So if you have the opportunity to pick this up, I can already tell you because I've already gone through this. It's awesome. You should probably do it. Um, it's 25 bucks. This is volume one. Um, volume two is going to come probably next year because they're about to do it again. Uh, if you watch the interview with Dirk Morrison at Hell City, you can see about how he's actually going to open it up to all artists, not just tattoo artists as well. So if you're an artist, and you want to get into it, you might want to contact Dirk Morrison about it. I'll put his contact info below so you can check that out. Uh, so this is the Pine Size Paintings book. You can see, it's really, I love this front picture. Uh, mainly because I just bought a macro lens myself, but it's really cool, like a little tiny easel. Now these pictures, you can see in here, they go in here. This talks all about uh, the Pine Size Paintings project, but as you can see here, like these pictures, you guys see my hand, I'm going to have a big hand. Uh, here. There you go, that's how big they are. These are the real size of the painting. So you can see how much detail, I'm not sure if this will focus, but you can see how much detail is in these paintings and they get pretty crazy. Um, it lists the artist's name over here and where they're from. This one's sick, you had to see that one in person. Um, but yeah, these, it's just it's just a, uh, like a good coffee table book. So we have these the two piece ones that are nice. Um, I'm not gonna go through the whole thing because I don't wanna give it away, but. You can just see, like, some of his work is really crazy stuff. Um, it's definitely really cool. If you're into tattoo art, uh, if you're into art in any way or shape or form, oh, I should also that. Uh, but you should check this book out. It's really cool. It's great to add to your collection. It's a great coffee table book. And it comes with this. I got this little magnifying glass. Mm. Oh, that makes, like, no difference. That's some weird shit. In my eye, I see the difference. Can you think too close? Oh, there you go. Oh, sorry. I'm a little drunk. Anyway. Um, yeah, so there's some, there's some really good stuff in here. Uh, some of the artists uh, that I can think of that have done this, uh, let's see what we got. I wonder if there's like a little thing where I can just name off the artist. Let's see. crazy though, right? Isn't this, I mean, you can just sit here and stare at these little pictures for hours. I mean, this, I flew back from Ohio, I was looking over this book, and the whole entire flight I went through was looking through this book. So some artists names we got uh, Richard Preston, Darren Slavic, Bob Pelgan, Scott Santee, Chris Hinkle, uh, Don McDonald, Tim Kern, oh shit, sorry, there's a glare. 
There we go. Tim Kern, uh, Stuart Morrison, Miss May, Jeff Eisinger, Tina Forever, Aaron Bell, Monk Taylor, Thomas Knitz. I like this one a lot. I like. I think these are my favorites, honestly. Uh, Carlos Lopez, Bex Long, I think Nick Baxter's in here, Kurt Wiscombe, Canadian Viking, uh, Stefano, Little Dragon, from Last Race Guys, Carlos Roja. There's, there's just there's a lot of really good tattoo artists that uh, made some amazing paints, and Nick Baxter starts off the book. So that is Pint Science Paintings Volume 1, Miniature Paintings by Big Artists. Um, you check it out, I'm pretty sure you can probably pick this thing up. I'm gonna put... So, I'm gonna put a link as to where you can pick this book up, because I don't really know offhand. I'm sure you can get it online. Um, so I'm gonna provide the links down uh, beneath here. So look down there. You'll see links to pick up the High Size Paintings book. If you have a chance to see it in person, it's, I highly, highly recommend it. If you're in the New York area, July 9th, the Pint Size Paintings Gallery is going to be on display at Sacred in uh, Chinatown, New York, New York. Um, trying to think what else. Yeah, the Derp's going to be out here. He's probably going to be crashing at my place. So if you guys are out here and you want to hang, hang out and get a drink, shoot me up. I'm totally down. Let's do it. Uh, so that's it. That's the review of the Pint Size Paintings. And I hope you guys get to see those paintings in person because it's an amazing gallery to see. Uh, sorry. Um, one last thing here uh, before I sign off is I just want to give you guys a little hint of something. See these big boxes over here? See they're big. Like look, see this? I'm seven feet tall. This is my ass. My ass. That's how high these are. You know what those are? You see what that is? Those are brand new Dell Power Ridge R300 rack mount servers. Fucking loaded to the max. Those are the new BodyMod TV, BodyMod.org servers. I put out close to four grand to get these things in. Uh, so we have pimp servers. It's gonna take me a little bit to set them up, obviously, and I'm leaving for a week, so they're gonna be sitting there waiting for me to get back. I'm Adam, and you're watching BodyMod TV. I'll see you guys in Krakow.